Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. It's the flower dance day. All right. Good morning to you, flower dancer. We don't have to go to the flower dance. I'm not a fan of dancing. Maybe I can give you a private dance tonight? Uh, I don't know. We don't have enough living space, and we can't invite everybody here and do the whole do-do-do-do-do-do-do. I'm not wearing the prison outfit. That's just weird. So, uh, I, I'm not 100% sure on that one. So, um, all right, I guess we're, we'll, uh, we'll see you at the flower dance? I don't know when, uh, when, where, why, how we run into uh, the next thing. Here's a vegetable from the little garden to keep out back. You probably have more veggies than you know what to do with, but oh well. I know what to do with that. I sell it. Add to my coffers. <laughs> Thank you very much, Calum. Okay, oh good, we got, a, we got a pearl. We can give that away. Um, okay, we got wine to make. Alright, in we go. Alright, star fruit. Uh, oh, we got more star fruit here. Very good. Okay. So, uh, I don't know what time the flower dance starts out here. Hold up, kitty cat. I'm so sorry. Oh, can't get around. Poor cat. Okay, did everybody... They already came to work, I guess. Feels nice to actually not be hiding things from you. I know it was real secretive about my whole dad thing, but I didn't want to scare you away with my trauma. The only thing you're hiding is uh, your entire being. Okay. So, yeah, interestingly, I don't know if... Um, like, is she going to be upset if I go to the flower dance and she has to go do that? Is she going to be like, oh gosh, I just didn't want to. Why are you making me dance with the flowers, sir? Ah, oh, every day is the same. Stuck in those horrible shelves, going to the saloon, tossing and turning all night. Stop making it sound so fun. Um, I wanted to see if Claire was around today. What time did we open here? Is it nine? Does it say on here? George Mart opened nine. Yeah, okay. Oh, Claire's over at the bus stop. Well, I was over there. Bang. I was buzz on back. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much. When no one's looking, I practice dancing. I haven't been caught yet. Because everyone's always looking. Stardew Valley is nice, but I wish I knew more people. I'm glad we would become friends. Yeah, have a, have a cup of tea. I know you're, we don't really need to, but... Alright. <laughs> well, she's headed off to her farm. I, I feel like there's a 0% chance she's going to be hanging out at the uh, the dance here. Hey, kid. Nah, I'm not hiding. I'm on the welcoming committee. Yeah, I volunteered for the job. If only to get out of the dancing. I was hiding in the corner. Being a ne'er do well. Hey, Juliet. How quaint. Everyone's all paired off neatly off. Want to shake it up a bit? Go on. Ask Sebastian to dance. I dare you. Um, not this year. Already, we've already done this. My spring air is so. The spring air is so fragmented. I should buy some flowers to brighten up the end. What do you got here, bud? No. Hey, gang. I don't know if I'll ask anyone to dance. I haven't really connected with that many people here, you know? Oh, uh, you won't be my partner for the flower dance? Okay, I look forward to it. Oh, crud. Uh, are you going to be dancing today? I wanted to uh, da dance freestyle, but Lou said it wasn't that type of dance. I wore my best shirt for the dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. Glad to see you here. Hey, sweetie, I'm sorry. Hey, you want to eat lots and lots of food with me? I do. Club, club, club. How do I look, honey? I should have brought my fishing pole. You're stunning. Would you do me the honor of being my dance partner? Assuming you're talking to to her and not me. Now this is the life, huh, kids? Sweet wine, a babbling brook, warm air, did I mention wine? 
frog season is really starting to pick up? Don't tell me anymore. You know what? I admit it. I really like flowers. Yeah, it doesn't, man. Ugh. And not good for allergies, I guess. I really hate dancing in front of everyone. It's so embarrassing. Mm, excellent sauce. Folk dancing? How very rustic. This bears little resemblance to the dances I attend demanded in Grampleton. Now those were sophisticated affairs. Ask someone to dance? Oh, I couldn't possibly. Celebration of love and fertility. I hope I am not expected to dance. People might laugh, although I suppose I could always do the unhip hop. I've been working on these flower, arrange flower arrangements for a week. Do you like them? They're lovely. Flowers, I can hardly see them. I found some leeks during our walk over here. The stuff is better than most of the food in here. Olivia looks charming. Flower dance is a traditional and symbolic means of expressing our tribute to the passing seasons. Uh, no, not yet. I got people to talk to. What a beautiful day for the flower festival. I'm just enjoying the scenery, creep. I'm practicing my dance moves. It needs to be perfect. Alex is ogling you, so I, I think you're fine. My mom told me to get out of the house and socialize. Hey, Claire. Flowers here are beautiful. There's such a large variety. Marlon. Marty looks lovely today. I would be young again and have someone to dance with. Oh, couldn't possibly ask him. What if he says no? Yeah, he's not going to. It's lovely to see everyone gather today, but a little overwhelming, too. Oh, well, hello there. It's nice of you to talk to me. Spring is almost over. What a shame. Flowers here are nice, but they aren't as colorful as back home. I'm working up the courage to ask someone to dance with me. Oh, I'm nervous. I like dancing, but this one's a little stilted. The old timers really love it, though. I wonder if Emily would dance with me. No, she will not. Aren't the flowers beautiful? I feel like I'm in heaven. I wish Pierre would spend this time with the family. Ooh, I'm stuffed. Hey, have you tried the red jelly yet? Every year I come here saying I'll never dance, but then I see people like you and Sterling having so much fun. I may be not be the best dancer, but I guess it doesn't hurt to get out there and shake a leg, right? Just promise you won't laugh. What's up, handsome? Hope you've been polishing up your steps this year. Wouldn't want to step on any toes this time around. Even if you don't ask me to dance at the event, you better end up saving me a dance for later. You betcha, buddy. Yeah, I'm feeling incredibly proud of the setup this year. I helped with the committee grow the flowers and we ended up with some gorgeous results. Please don't mind me. I need to gush over the color of the tulips this year. The breakthroughs are so exciting. Oh my gosh, there's more. <laughs> Gatherings uh, such as this give me a great opportunity to talk to Carolyn and Jody. Talk to the plebs. The air smells so sweet with all the flowers. These springtime dances can be traced back to ancient fertility rituals. Hey, you should know about this stuff, farmer. Are you going to be dancing today? This open field makes me nervous. Happy thoughts, Kent. Happy thoughts. Oh, Kent. Hey, Eloise. Hey, farmer. You should ask my dad to dance. He never dances with anyone but me. I think he misses mom too much. Oh, I would, kiddo, but I accidentally asked someone else to dance. I suppose I'll let you flower be flower queen if you really, really want to, Vincent. Vincent is in a fug state. Uh, one day I'm going to be the bestest flower queen ever. You will, buddy. All right, well, uh, let's do this. I think I talked to everybody. Who did I agree to dance to? I don't even know. Who am I dancing with there? It's not... Oh, it's, uh, what's his face? <laughs> Cynthia's brother. Oh my gosh. I couldn't have remembered after talking to the 87 villagers. The animations are pretty cute though. Those are well done. The little dancing happiness. All right, so did we get talking? Yeah, we got talking points with everybody. Oh, it's interesting. Okay, I didn't even realize. Think about some of the people not attending. Right, of course. But that's okay. Um, who didn't I, I... Oh, Magnus. Where was Magnus? Interesting. Magnus and Lance. They're, uh, they're busy. They were occupied. Um, I guess that was a quick day. All right, let's do another day.
Should we have a baby? Uh, you sure. <laughs> I don't know that I'm going to get to having a baby. I don't remember how long it takes. I feel like it's a bit. That was, I forgot about that. <laughs> Completely forgot about the kids option. Okay, so it's the 25th, wowzers. Good morning. I don't think I have anything good to give you. Good morning, I made some coffee. I'll, I'll be at the vineyard all day. Cuddles tonight. Pat Sophia on the head. Exclamation marks. Okay, so we're, we're maxed out on our hearts with her, so yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Can't be good doing heavy labor all the time. Okay, Juliet. Oh, Juliet, I haven't gifted. How did I pass by Juliet? Oh, that's super weird. Oh, wait, I was still working on Juliet, wasn't I? That's what it was. Oh my gosh. Where did I lose? I don't even know. Okay. No idea what happened there. Okay, we got some uh, good stuff I'm gonna use, I guess, on market day on Friday. I was conducting a field study the other day and I found this specimen. I hope you find it as interesting as I did. It's a bream. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate the breams. Put the flowers there. Well, I guess I'll hold that one. Uh, there we go. Yeah, we got some stuff. Okay, so let's go and get ourselves some more Super Joge. Kitty cat. Yeah, I know. Um, might be quickest to actually just warp out to East Scarp. And then we'll come out this way. Hey, Sterling. I've been trying to have some strong coffee in the morning to avoid alcohol. It's not going well, but maybe it'll get better if I keep at it. Okay, I want to go up to... Oh, I think I went the wrong way. I need to be further up if I want to go to Morris's. Does this lead to his... There we go. His mansion. Hey, dude. How's it going, Morris? Thank you for speaking with me. How fair is your day? No one else around here strikes up as much conversation as you do. And off I go. <laughs> right, I always forget the garbage can. That's such a good detail, because he totally would lock his garbage. It would be the one annoying person I couldn't check their garbage. Like, drat you. It's open at 10 today. It's this post-festival day. What's Clint doing out in the yard here? Hey, dude. I see to say hi in my backyard. <laughs> some backyard, champ. Some backyard. Okay, what do we have going on here? Prismatic jelly. Uh, jar of prismatic jelly. Eh. I think like tropical fish. Bring in a good island hole. I don't know that I want to do either of those two things. I do want to go see Sophia at her, at her winery, though. Head over to the blue moon. What's she doing? Wine cellar. Huh. No idea where she is. Maybe I, uh, I I beat her there or something. All right, well, let's go and see Magnus. We haven't seen him in a few days. It was looking kind of weird over there. Oh, she's over helping here. Andy, found me a hefty number of dandelions, leeks, and horseradishes in the forest this morning. I'll wager these fetch a modest price. Potentially. Hey, Scarlet. Andy is super strong. He carried four bags of fertilizer at once. Okay, that's that's uh. Andy's gonna have to go see the doctor for a hernia surgery. All right, 
right, let's zip on over to the Wiz and add nobody down there. Okay, wizard. Yeah, I wonder if he was creeping at the flower dance. I don't know. Hey, bud. Today I'm strengthening the ward that protects the valley. I'm happy to do the work of maintaining them. Right, okay. Uh, Scarp. Island. Desert. Okay, we got the... 10 iridium bars, 10 earth crystals. Uh, let's see here. Um, I got 11 iridium bars. Yeah, I do have the earth crystals. There we go. Okay, let's build one of these. Somewhere where I don't have a thousand other things going on. Oh, overshoot. Okay, I think I will... I'm not going to bother putting spacing in. Alright, there we go. Another one down. And after that one, I don't know. Um, I mean, the island would be nice. I guess the desert is the main next one, but that's a million. Yeah, I guess it's the desert. So I need a million. And then uh, just the reading bars and stuff. I think we'll be able to manage that. Okay, so who do we want to go and see now? Um, yeah, I mean, I could, could go see Juliet. Where is she? And do I have... Let's see, uh, Fabled Reef. There we go. Oh yeah, we got two things today. Nice. Normally she's working out in the woods here. But I don't know. I I can't remember where I've been. See, oh, there she is. Yep. We walked right past her. Oh, no, it's Dolores. Maybe when I attempt this world record thing, I could raise some money for cancer research. That'd be pretty cool, right? So where is Juliet right now? Um... Juliet. Movie theater. Oh. Oh, is she working at the movie theater? I do not remember. That wigged me out. <laughs> Whoa. I think the mushrooms may have taken over. I think we have, we might have a problem. We have a mushroom problem? There we go. Where am I? In the mushrooms. That is pretty cool. Kind of like letting us take over. Hey kitty. Off again. We'll go find her over here. Alright, let's see. Uh, hey Haley. What are you doing? Uh, that's interesting. Why are you, didn't, are you bathing in the fountain now? Is it, you've, it's come to this, has it? I cooked dinner last night, it actually turned out okay. But I did make a huge mess in the kitchen. No. Uh, was it because the last time I saw you, you were in your swimsuit and you're just like, you know what? Forget it, I'm sticking to this. I am gonna go to the movies by myself. Which one am I? I thought I might see Juliet here, but I forgot that uh, it, you lose the ability to move once you get inside. It takes over. The brave little sapling. Brave little sapling is leaving his home. He hesitates for a moment and turns around, knowing he won't be back for a long time. The other saplings of his grove are gathered at the edge of town, excitedly waving their twigs goodbye. Oh no, out of nowhere it starts raining. The little sapling goes into a sprint as thunderstorm clouds loom overhead. To be happy to be. While fearing for his life and demoralized by the relentless downpour, the brave little sapling begins to lose hope. But what's this? The sapling feels a tingling on top of his head. 
top. Perhaps a little rain was what it needed to begin its journey into becoming a tree. Farewell, little buddy. The movie is concluded for tonight. We hope you enjoyed the show. Well, that was, a, that was a wild ride. How are you ladies doing? Okay. Haley's engaging in conversation about the film. Interestingly, I wonder when when they're busy doing their own thing and you try to talk to them. Um, does that count as like, if I look at, there's Emily. No, it doesn't count. Huh. Hey, Jesse. Rosemary's for Rembrandt. Sassant always makes me remember those we have loved and those we have lost. Juliet is not the first soul I've taken under my wing, and it's a pleasure to set them free. But each that fledges takes a piece of my heart. Alright, how's it go, bud? I found this while I was exploring the caves. I thought you might find it useful. It's frozen here. Thanks, man. Maybe she's in fact... Up here? She's having a day? Oh, what's this? I love it. It's another cutscene that I haven't seen yet. You never know. Oh, what is this? I've opened a... Oh my Lexi, where are you now? Hello Ma Dodge, welcome to my basement and my most precious secret. I know what you're thinking. Did I have a child? And the answer is no. But also, yes. There was a terrible storm. The wind howled like a wild animal in pain, and the rain fell in a furious deluge. The next morning, all was calm and still, as though the storm had never been. But something drew me to the, be the beach. that. I brought them home, of course, this tiny infant wrapped in seaweed. Is that her friend in the cave? I dare not tell the other villagers of my foundling child. They wouldn't have understood. Many now are good folks, but back then there was a lot of distrust in the uncanny, and the storm took a lot of a lot from us. Is that Lexi? I scavenged what I could. Oh, they raised and raised Lexi as though they were my own. Whoa, okay, that's a cool backstory. I've always liked my children, and if things turned out differently, if I had turned out differently, what well, perhaps I would have had my own. Well, that's really neat. And as it is, I can't regret the path I've taken. I raised Lexi to the best of my ability, and taught Lexi not to be human, but to be humane. Lexi grew and thrived, but the ocean still held their heart. And it was no life for Lexi here, these two rooms, my garden, and the only water still and sterile. Lexi grew up and left me. I like the bird animated, the birds eating the sun. That's cute. I hope Lexi found their people. Lexi was not my child of blood, but the child of my heart. And not a day goes by that I do not miss them. Others might brand Lexi an animal, perhaps even a monster, but Lexi was not. They were just a child who needed to be loved. Wow. That was really cool. Okay, so we got some really neat backstory there. So are we able to go... Okay, we can go in the... Were we? I don't know if we were always able to go in there or not. Anything happening over here? Nope, nobody's chilling over here. All right, um, wow, I feel like we need to go see Lexi and find out some more. <laughs> Look at me, Shane, jump, jump, jump. Chad's wanted to go to the playground today. What do you guys say, Charlie? Buck. Typical Charlie. Um. Let's head over to Joja. They, uh, she might be working a shift today. 
Oh, Gremlin's here. Yeah, she must be working. Oh, no, it's Claire. My work ethic has nothing in common with my manager's. I'm not sure he even goes home. He pressures me to work overtime. I'm so tired after a shift here, but I do need the money. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, oh no, I should look at the map. Um... Claire. Yeah, so I did, okay, I did end up gifting everybody. Um... Hmm. So Juliet is still at the movie theater. All right, maybe, she, I don't know, was she behind the counter? Did I just not, was she working? I did not notice. It's possible I just, like, spaced out. I must have, something like that must have happened. All right, well, let's boogie over and see Lexi. And uh, I guess we could also see, do we have any pearls here? Not yet. Weeds are probably going to destroy all my plants. All right, let's get over here. I uh, could have warped home and just warped out. It would have been faster. This is, uh, I took the forever path. Hey, kid. Oh, I don't feel like talking today. Okay. I don't feel like talking today. Okay. All right. That's the, nobody, no pressure, man. There's the little kitty cat. Doing the kitty cat thing. Slurking around caves. Oh, here we go. It's good to see you. I have a surprise for you today. I think you will like this very much. Seaweed. It's very special seaweed. Friend Gull find it for me. It's from Special Reef far, far away. It helped you breathe underwater like me. What? I wonder, would friend like to go on an adventure with me? I'd love to. Oh my gosh, it's very exciting. You see my world, maybe one day I, I see your world again, yes? Cool, dude. Let's do this. Oh, I feel not so good. You can now temporarily breathe underwater. You okay, friend? Look a little green around gills. What? I'm glad, now come, swim, with, swim after me. Once long a time ago, many years ago, I went out look for my kin. I travel long, long way, see many things, see, see them too, my people. But when I talk to them, they not understand. They don't want me. I am not one of them. But on my way home, I find something wonderful. Come, come, I show you. All right, bud, follow me. Boop. Ooh, hello, underwater reef. Ship, she sank. Many, many years ago, carrying many treasures, most gone now, lost to sea, eaten by fish, but one marvelous thing, it remained. It's your turn now. He's not sure what ship be, where it go, but no, it carry many bottles. The label is worn by many years underwater, but you think it says Cherry Orchards. It's contain other things too, vases and pots, takes them back to home, and other things too. Wait here. Looking through the portal, you see a small cluttered room filled with splintered wood and crates. Ooh. Here, friend, is a gift for you. Moonflower seeds. It's a very special plant. It may be not mine to give, but nobody here to love it. You will love it, friend, Mod Hodge, and it will, you will help it grow, yes? You receive moonflower seeds. What, whatever could they grow? Now, want to swim with dolphin? Yes, please. Again, 
I keep thinking that uh, we must be done here. <laughs> and then cool stuff like that happens. You're like, what? Um, I guess moonflower seeds. Does it say any specific things? Plant in any season to produce a beautiful pearl. Okay, very nice. So, yeah, the, uh... That's neat. Uh, that now that these things, we've got them, but it makes more sense now that we've got the story to go with it. That's very cool. Um... Okay, and then... That's all good. Let's go put our iridium ore up here. I don't need to be packing that. Or that. Go throw this in here. Go throw that in there. We'll throw that in there. Um, I don't know why. What about 34 of these? Not even sure. That actually could grab a pile of them. Maybe. Somebody likes mussels? Alright. So, yeah, I got my stuff here. We're all good. Um, now, yeah, I guess I should be making sure I grab any iridium. Although I probably have a mountain of iridium. Although, I, I think I must have sold a lot of it. How are we doing there? 43 diamonds. Okay, we have three already more there. Okay, let's see here. Where Where's the iridium? Coupe. Okay, here we go. No iridium here, though. Uh, there we go. There is some iridium. Okay, well, I guess we'll take the ores there, sure. there. I don't know why I'm storing diamonds there. No idea. Um, okay, so we got our copper, we got our stuff. Good, so the iridium will just keep churning away. Good enough. So I've got four now. sell these as well. Alright, good enough. Um, yeah, I'd like to go see Julia. That's the main one I wanted to go and say hi to today. So I don't know if I just go and camp outside the theater. There she is. Hey, ever tried Jojo's Home brand meat sauce? I swear it tastes like dog food. You don't want to know how I know that. <laughs> that is distressing news. Okay, so I think we've done a bunch there. Yeah, that's really cool that we got the uh, Jesse's 10 uh, heart scene. Uh, so Juliet, we got one more heart. That's excellent. And then um, everybody else were still chiseling away at it. Uh, Sam. Yeah, I could have gone talking to more people today. Oh. Hey, Scarlet. I think I already... We did a lot of talking. Hey, Pierre, what's up? Don't tell my wife, but I hate to cook dinner. I'm sure she has some idea about this. Like, I think she might notice. I think I have an inkling.
buddy. Oh, you're you're busy. Okay. How's it going? It's good to see you. I accomplished a lot today. I hope you did too. I feel like I did. Although I also feel like I still have much more to do. Where's Olivia? I need to bellow. Olivia! I let myself into the bathroom. Uh, oh, there she is. Working a corporate job in the city was a different chapter of my life. It was, was for you too, sweetie. I'm happy we're both able to move on. That's just the thing. It's good to move on. Alright, who's here tonight? Hey, Emily. Sometimes the flowers speak to me. Each one has a different story to tell. Uh, no, Emily's working. Let's let her work. It's only Thursday. So it's gonna be a busy one next time. Kind of a big market event. I don't feel like doing anything today. No, that's just what she said. The air is starting to warm up. I'm feeling pumped. <laughs> I feel like you're always feeling pumped, buddy. Hey, good evening. Oh, he hears me breaking into his house. Hey, pal. The saloon can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes we even put a coin in a jukebox. Woohoo! Hibbity dibbity. Sometimes we even do a dance. You're a wild man, Horace. Too wild for me. Alright, that's fine. Okay, nobody's hanging out here. I think that's our cue. We'll get to bed at a good hour today. You have a good day. Don't overwork yourself, silly. If you need a cuddle break, just ask. Smooch. Alright. We will see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.